this is Cindy G with my scrap chick and in this video we are assembling the football envelope card I've got all the pieces laid out I have done some embossing on the panel pieces I don't know if you can see it on the video or not it's um, a leather look embossing folder to make it look like the skin of a football. But there are so many things you can do with these panels. You can do these in the color of your favorite team. Um. <clears throat> You can use a pattern paper. My son plays football for high school, so you could use your high school team colors. Or you can keep it generic, like I've done. Let's see, what do I want to do first? Let's put, I'm going to put the base together just so that I glue my pieces on the right side. I am notorious for <laughs> gluing things on the wrong side when I have multiple pieces so it's best for me to glue them together first so that I don't make that mistake. So you just want to line this right up to the score line. And I've glued it exactly straight, so let me force my fold to go the way it should. All right. So now I'm just going to put on these outside panel pieces. Like so. These look so cool. I probably should have added a little bit of ink, brush some ink over the top of them to make the embossing stand out a little bit more. Now, on the back side of this piece, you want to put your panel for your sentiment. This piece here, this goes on the inside. And that's one of the reasons why I like to put this together first, put the pieces together first, so that I'm putting that on the right side. This piece here, it just lines up to the bottom, edge to edge, goes right here. Oops. flip it over and do this piece on the inside. I'm sure to make a mess with all this glue. But we'll just see if I can get 
get it going here without I just need enough glue on these center slats just to hold them down so that they're not interfering with the card opening and closing. There we are. So that was pretty simple. So that is the inside. And now we can put together the inserts. The goal post is the back insert. I think this would even make a good birthday card, especially like for my husband. He loves football. So I would do this in gold and black for him. He is a diehard Steelers fan. It would make a good, like, thank you card for a coach. There we are. And so now we're going to do the inserts. We'll start with the back. What we're going to do is open this up flat and lay it flush against. So this is how it will set inside the card. So we have it laying flush right against the edge, laying flat on the back with your tab laid out open. And we're going to put glue on this tab. Now we're gluing it here to the side. There we go. Now for the next piece, we're going to do the same thing. Except this time we're laying it right up against the back piece. And we're going to put glue on the tab. Leaving it open. Just 
lay it in there. Oops. Apply pressure. And now you see that it's lined up right against the layer behind it. I'm going to put glue on both tabs and I'm going to stay just inside the score line and just inside the outer edge because I don't want the glue to seep out and glue this piece to the piece in front of it. And what I'm doing is this is the side here and that's going to lay down flat and I'm going to fold it to where the opposite side is laying flat and bring it over just like this. Now I'm gluing them both on this side. I'm going to fold it both ways. And then I'm going to add glue to this tab and close it up. There we are. And there is the football envelope card. Thank you for joining me.